Today's a very exciting day and it's my birthday tomorrow. I just did a face mask because um, I woke up with like painful pimples. And then I added some of this hardest working triple threat cream, which you've probably seen me post about on Instagram, but this is one of my favorite creams right now. It's like the perfect amount of moisturizing, but it doesn't leave my skin oily. My skin's not looking the best. I don't know what's going on. It's probably from all the chocolate and chips I've been eating. Fabian's picking me up soon and then we're going to be staying at a hotel tonight like we did for his birthday in one of my other vlogs that you might have seen. But we're trying out a different hotel and I don't know what we're doing before we check in. I think we might be going to the art gallery and getting some lunch. So follow us around and see what we get up to. I'm still packing and I don't know what to wear today because it was supposed to be hot. So I had an outfit, a summery outfit planned, but now I woke up and it's not cold, but it's not hot and it's very cloudy. So yeah. My room's so messy, just ignore that. I don't know if I should wear this outfit or this blue ribbed singlet dress. I don't know. I think I'm gonna go with this dress. It's just easy and comfy. Ready to go. Guys, I'm proud of myself. I was able to compact everything into a small suitcase. Last time I brought a massive one for one night. Mm. Excited! So Let's excited. go! Let's go! So excited to see this hotel. I've never been to this one. And then it's a surprise from there. I don't know what else we're doing. And tomorrow there's mm. something. Apparently I had to bring sneakers and shorts. Was it something we're doing? Yeah, it's up to you if you want to wear sneakers, but... <laughs> Yeah, it's good to have them. Yeah, don't worry, it's nothing too exciting. Jeez. Jeez. Jeez Louise. I'm kind of hungry and I can't wait to eat something. Okay, well we'll get there and we'll check in and we'll eat. Oh, maybe we can't check in, but we'll leave our bags and we'll go eat. Yeah. What time was check-in, did they say? They said two, but I called up and she put my name down for early, like as soon as the room's available. Yeah. They'll give me the whatever room's there, is what she said. That's what we did for your birthday and it was like ready right, right away and I was like, yay. Yeah.
happy with my makeup. I just wanted kind of a natural glowy look, very effortless. And I've got my new Louis Vuitton earring. I got my first ever designer, um, designer items. Like I've never owned anything designer and I just bought it for myself. I didn't even tell Fabian or anyone when I got the parcel. So that's exciting. It's my little birthday slash Christmas present. But you know that I love gold jewelry and gold hoops and these are just so pretty but we're starving so we're gonna go eat I don't know it's a surprise where we're going so come along with us oh, we don't have to wear masks like we did in four seasons oh, <laughs> So good. Morning, guys. Look at our breakfast. Wow. What a feast. <coughs> breakfast with the view. Hey, everyone. So we're just packing up to leave the hotel. I love the view so much, it's so pretty. Um, but Fabian surprised me and we're going to go on, I forgot the name, it's like a jet ski boat. It's kind of like a boat that rides along that water out there, but it's like really fast and it's like kind of like a ride. So it'll be a bit scary, but it'll be fun. And then later we're just having family and two of my friends over, just really chill. I don't I didn't like having like big events and parties where I'm the center of attention, <laughs> like I just, I've never had like a birthday party like that. But yes, my camera just said that it's going to die. So <laughs> I'll see you guys when I see you. Guys, we just finished the jet boat and it was so fun. It's the funnest thing I've done in two years. And I feel like I can't see, I've got salt all over my face. You are absolutely drenched. Hello. <laughs> We look like we've been hit by a bus for a second. It was so much fun. Everyone. So it's a couple days later and I just thought I didn't talk much in the vlog I just kind of put the camera down and did a lot of like time lapses with music over it I thought I'd just do a little haul of the stuff I got for my birthday um, from friends and family and from myself I had the best birthday ever and thank you for all your sweet messages on Instagram It was such a hot day on my birthday It was like 40 degrees and we had all these people in the house and everyone was just sweating But it was a fun night We played some crazy competitive Pictionary Which is like a tradition for my family So it was fun Okay, let's get into what I got So from Fabian's mum I got this beautiful Mimco wallet which is what I've been wanting for ages because I did have a Mimco wallet before. It was a black one, but it's gotten all worn out. So I was like, a nice fresh one would be lovely. So it's got a pocket on this side and then just the gold Mimco logo. And I love this tan color. I feel like this goes with everything. It's not too beige. It's not too brown. Look, it's like the color of my wall kind of. But yeah, I just feel like that matches everything. My brother got me the smaller version, but yeah, they're very similar. So I don't know if I'll keep this one. My brother got me this one and it's actually a small wallet. I thought it was like a pouch, but I was like, I don't need two wallets. But I was also like, this could fit in my smaller bags. And then this is my everyday handbag one. But yeah, I don't know. I might exchange it for just like a little pouch to keep my cards in for when I take my small bags out. But this is really nice too. I just don't know if I'll, oh. <laughs> I just don't know if I'd use uh, this bit. And then I got these two bags myself from Mimco. I'm just sitting on my floor because my bed is all messy and has heaps of stuff on it. But yeah, I got these two gorgeous bags from Mimco. I just really wanted a nice quality little bag for summer to wear with summer dresses. And when I go out, you can dress them up or down. But I love this white one. It's got gold details and then this texture along the front. 
and you can actually fit a lot in it because it's got two zip compartments and then also like a compartment in the middle where you can like put your phone in and it's easy to like take out but I hate bags that don't have a zip and you kind of feel like all your stuff could just fall out or someone could just steal your stuff so I always get um, handbags with a zip enclosure I just feel more safe and secure with that so it's like a crossbody shoulder bag length this is the same design but in a brown tan I'm just liking this color for summer to go with you know sandals and a summer dress and you look really still classy and dressed up love these so much I can't wait to use them a lot and they're really good quality so they're going to last me a long time because they were quite pricey my friend Annika got me this really nice candle it's from dusk in the scent Lotus and it's got a really pretty packaging as well it's very my style and then she also got me these crystals I've never had crystals before and Annika knows a lot about energy and crystals so I'm just gonna leave these in my office or in my room to give me good calming energy I also got chocolate and a doormat that says cats welcome people tolerated from Nicola so shout out to Nicola that was a really funny cute gift from my mum she got me and Fabian a couples massage from Indota Spa if you're from Sydney you have to try out Indota well I haven't tried it out but my mum has and Fabian's mum has and they love it so I can't wait to book this I'll probably book it today and we can go on the weekend and get a relaxation massage I love massages so much and I might get a facial as well I forgot to show you my new Gucci bag um, when we were at the hotel but but I got to wear it out for the first time when we went out to dinner that night but yes I got this little mini Gucci bag it's a shoulder bag I like the gold chain and yeah I think it's just a staple and a classic that will be used for a long time my first ever designer bag I'm not trying to show off either this is very special to me it's just like kind of a little achievement from the year so the reason I got all this stuff as well is because my birthday landed on Black Friday so I got all of these on sale like the Mimco bags and then this makeup I'm gonna show you and some dresses that I got but yeah I did spend way more money than I should have I did a Sephora haul and then I also got a Mecca voucher and another Sephora voucher on my birthday so I've already used them so I'm just waiting for them to come in the mail so from Sephora I got the Fenty Beauty Hydrating Foundation I already have this but I got it in a darker shade I got it in 300 which is one shade darker than the one I have because I have gotten tan since I've been in the pool a lot recently and it's officially summer here I got this blush which I'm wearing today probably a bit put a bit too much because I made a TikTok before this um, it's the Clinique Cheek Pop Blush in Peach Pop, and I just love this colour. I feel like it's not very pigmented, like I have to really layer it on to like show a bright colour. So it's alright, it's not amazing. I haven't tried out this Saint Laurent lipstick yet, but I saw someone use it on TikTok, and it's a really nice brownie rust colour. But I didn't have anything like that, it's like an orangey lipstick, but it's more of a lip gloss sheen kind of formula so i'm excited to try that out i was in need of some new brushes so i got this zoeva Lux sheer cheek 127 brush which i used today for my blush i think it's a really nice blush brush i don't have any fancy brand brushes so this is like my first time buying expensive brushes um, this one's also zoeva in the 146 concealer perfecta and when you're looking online you can't tell how big the brushes are because it's like a zoomed in image of the brush and I thought this was way bigger than it was like I thought it'd be a big concealer brush but it, it seems too small like I'll never use this I don't know I don't know maybe I'll try it out with concealer next time oh they're all Zoeva okay so this one's the face paint 109 vegan brush I don't have anything this shape again I thought this was way bigger but I think this will be good for cream contouring and blush it is quite a nice it's very soft and it's a nice shape so so yeah I haven't tried it out yet but I'll let you know if I like this one I didn't buy this I got sent this a while ago from Mecca it's the N28 primer serum from Hourglass and it is so luxurious I think it's really expensive but it smells really nice and it's like the ultimate hydrating primer very like glossy and 
like super super hydrating so if you have super oily skin it doesn't I don't think it'll work for you it's kind of a bit heavy for my skin because I do have normal to oily skin but I've been loving that for like a summer glow look recently and I got this on Black Friday from adorebeauty.com I got the skin SkinCeuticals Retinol which is the vitamin A cream and I got it in the lowest strength the 0.3% pure retinol so I tried that out for the first time last night and it didn't feel I thought it might feel like drying and super strong but I didn't really feel anything from it so maybe I'll have to get the next strength up soon maybe after I, after using this for a few months I might have to step up to the next level because I am still struggling with acne around this area you can't see because of my makeup but yeah I've still got lots of bumps and spots here and my doctor recommended for me to try out vitamin vitamin A for my acne and then using vitamin C in conjunction in conjunction with vitamin A is supposed to help a lot. So I use vitamin C cleanser in the morning and then this at night. I also got this cute pink shirt top from Glassens on the Black Friday sales and I got this beautiful Beckon Bridge dress which I wore on my birthday. Um, for my family dinner. I've been eyeing this one out and I was like I'll wait if it goes on sale for Black Friday but it didn't end up going on sale so I just used like their welcome 15% off discount. But it's a maxi dress, it goes right down to my feet and I just love the orange floral print and it's got a tie up back with a zipper as well. It's just really nicely fitted and it's also got a cutout under the bra bit but yeah my new favorite dress and I know it was expensive but I know that I it's timeless and I'll use it for the next few summers to come I can't wait to wear this one out it's more of a dressy dressy dress <laughs> so it's this really nice silky material this is probably the most expensive dress I've ever bought it's also got like a cutout under the bra section but it's like you can tighten it so it's only like a tiny bit of skin showing or you can loosen it but it's also a deep V cut so, so if I wear it I'll have to like tape this these bits down because I think they'll gape open because I don't have any boobies yeah it's also a maxi dress and it's just stunning it's got like puffy sleeves and I think it I just think it was really unique and it was just something that I've been looking for for ages and when I saw it I fell in love and then I was like wait it's way too expensive so then I didn't buy it and I was like I'll wait for Black Friday but it didn't go on sale so I just got this one and the orange dress together because I really really love them you know when you leave something in your cart for a long time and you're like you'll see if you get sick of it or not I would wear this with cute little slide on heels and my Gucci bag and my gold earrings my bank account hates me <laughs> on Black Friday. I also got some sandals from Bellini because they were having a sale and I love Bellini. They have the nicest shoes. These are like fancy thongs. They're just white thongs but they've got a nice flat band and I like the square toe shape. These are my favourite pair that I got, these linen strappy slides. I just think I'll use these to death in summer and they're really nice quality as well. They just go with all my dresses and they'll go with any bag. I just like the natural linen look. It's very beachy. And the last ones from Bellini, I got these strap tie up ones. I didn't have any this color or in this style of like the strappy tie up vibe. I just think they'll be so nice in summer and you can kind of dress it up. Like these would go nice with either of these dresses and then my Mimco bag. I feel very spoiled and my bank account is crying but I just love fashion. <laughs> Alright, so that's the end of my little random haul from Black Friday sales and my birthday. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Let me know if you want to see more of them or if you want to request any specific videos down below. Please feel free to. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon in my next video.